morning, South Africa. The third director's collection of wildlife encounters got off to a fine start this week with the exhibition of 88 original paintings at Delta Park in Johannesburg. 66 works will be included in the final publication of this prestigious volume. The collection is due for release in April next year, and the theme, In Full Flight. Julie Hyde-New and cameraman Andre Hoos report. Tony Davidson and John Richardson consider this a breakthrough for South African wildlife artists. Someone said to us some time ago, said, you know, all South African wildlife art is very static. We've seen so many cheetahs sitting on top of anthills, looking over their right shoulders, lions resting under a tree. So we took the idea of movement and came up with the idea of in full flight. flight. When we first talked to them and broached the subject of in full flight, virtually all of them said, please count me out. There's no reference, no reference of sources whatsoever. When they thought about it, uh, the majority of them said, you know, I have done some sketches in the field, or um, I think I can find some, some blurred photographs of animals on the move. Could I have a go? And uh, yes, we'd like to try and meet that challenge. screams was Henk Forst, who has created a series of paintings depicting a fish eagle on the hunt. When I was first uh, commissioned to take part, they asked me for a picture of the cheetah and one of a fish eagle. And then John's such a dynamic person, he convinced me that he'd like a series of the fish eagle uh, spiting the fish and then, then she's swooping down, catching the fish and then going to sit and eat it in a tree. He made that sound so exciting that I said, if that's a challenge you give me, I'll accept it. The reference material just came pouring in. I found that it's um, very difficult to edit out which is the right one to do. So I had more uh, ideas than I actually had time to be hung them and I think it well. It is a great amount of kudos to be actually selected for publication in this highly prestigious volume. As an ongoing publication, it's probably the most expensive production on the continent of Africa. If one looks at the publishing costs and the production costs, you're actually looking at one million rand a year. And the exhibition at Delta Park is open to the public until the 29th of this month when all the paintings will be auctioned off.